You know what this is? This is called a Gorilla Pod. It's made by a brand called Joby, and essentially, it is a flexible tripod. I've been using different versions of this thing right here for a few years, ever since I started making videos. And I'm very excited to be one of the first people in the world to get my hands on the brand new version of this Gorilla Pod. This one right here is called the Gorilla Pod 3K Pro. So for me, the most special thing about this Gorilla Pod is the fact that it is made from aluminum. So this thing is so much stronger than previous versions that I believe were made from plastic. And I'm way more comfortable putting my camera on top here and trusting this to hold it and support me as an independent filmmaker. <laughs> no, but really this thing is great. So in this video, I'm gonna be taking you around. I'm currently in Chiang Mai, Thailand, so I wanna show you a little behind the scenes as to how I film my travel videos and how I use my Gorillapod in different ways. You can wrap it, you can stand it, you can grip it. So let's get into the video, shall we? So since the Gorillapod is now metal and much stronger, I think it's time for me to hit the gym and try to get myself stronger. For the record, I'm done trying to make y'all comfortable. For the record, you ain't trying to grow, then it's done for you. For the record, lab on me going all the way. For the record, ain't trying to link no time to waste. For the record, for the record, for the for the record, for the record, for the record, for the record. For the rugged. Been a little too nice to y'all. Now I gotta up price for y'all. Snake eyes on dice for y'all. Shoulders on ice for y'all. Frozen. It can be pretty fun trying to get creative and find cool places to wrap the gorilla pod, but it's often very frequently that I'm just sitting at a table like this talking to the camera and using the gorilla pod as a tripod. So right here in front of me, I have what is called Cow soy. It is a red curry with yellow noodles, just a whole chicken leg, and crunchy noodles on top. And oh my goodness, does this taste so good. So I'm gonna enjoy this, but I just wanted to show you another example of how I use my Gorilla Pod in just an everyday setup. I don't always have the convenience of a flat surface when I'm looking to set up a shot. So right here, I'm actually using the seat of a motorbike and it is not very even at all, but with the Gorilla Pod, a unique function is you can twist it and move it however you want. And right now it's Sunday night here in Chiang Mai, so we're gonna head into this night market and see what that's like. As a travel vlogger, I often find myself in public situations like this where I want to show my surroundings, talk about what I'm experiencing, and having this nice grip on my hand with this Gorilla Pod just makes it so much easier. And it also extends a little bit too, so you get that extra reach to show more in the background. Very helpful. One last thing I haven't mentioned yet is this pretty little thing right at the top here. This is a ball head, so you take this little twisty thing right here, you twist that, it loosens this so you can swivel it however you want, get that right position, make sure you're facing up, and also a really cool feature is this little ridge so you can easily switch to portrait mode, get those Instagram photos or some stories or whatever you use vertical things for. This is great for that. <laughs> and that brings us to the end of this video, so I hope you enjoyed a little behind the scenes look as to how I film my travel videos with a Gorilla Pod. If you're not already, I'd appreciate if you click that subscribe button or leave one of these, a thumb down below. Not down, but up, yeah, a, a like. And I'll leave a link in the description to Joby's site so you can check out the all new Gorilla Pod 3K Pro. <laughs> because it's stronger now, get it? Anyway, thank you so much, Joby, for sponsoring this video. Everyone else, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next vlog. Peace.